Hey everyone, Sarah here from Earth Spirit. It's um, Tuesday the 18th of June, so it's um, it's my dad's birthday today. But um, yeah, so moving right along towards winter solstice Yule, which is coming up this weekend. But um, so yeah, and it's and you can feel it like we had a bit of a frost this morning. But anyway, I'm doing the video this way because um, as you saw yesterday, the live doesn't work. So um, it just drops out repetitively. I don't even remember how many times it dropped out yesterday. <laughs> um, and it was very frustrating. So I've just decided to do it this way till we get it sorted. Because um, NBN just doesn't work good enough. We're still waiting on Starlink. Looks like they might have to send us a new unit. So hopefully that's coming from Sydney, not America. And it, if they do send it, it will be here in a couple of days. And I should be up and running again um, but everything like the FPOS is still working out here at the NBN's good enough to do the FPOS and so if you want to come out and have a look at the shop there's appointments available and the, the FPOS is working um, also if you'd like to book into some of the events this Saturday we've got the crystal workshop at 11 o'clock from 11 to 12 for 30 dollars that's going to be like all about different crystals how to look after them how to clean them all sorts of things about crystals like kind of an introduction to crystals um, and we'll be program programming them we'll be doing all sorts of things with them so that's um, this Saturday at 11 and then I can't wait I can't wait I've got a lot of things I've got to do before the wheel of the year circle Yule or winter solstice that's coming up this Saturday from 5 to 6 30 I've got so many activities for us so we it won't be so much I'll be going a little bit into what, what winter solstice means and we'll be doing a little bit of um, work on different things like releasing um, welcoming back the Sun all that sort of thing um, letting the light and the fire energize us because hopefully it'll be a daylight today and we'll be able to have the fire down the back so um, yeah it will be but we'll be mainly doing lots of different activities rather than just sitting and talking about it so it's going to be really fun. I, I'm gonna, I can tell you that you'll really enjoy it. Um, even if it rains, it's still going to be fun. So, um, and I was thinking if it rains, you know, we might not be able to put the things in the fire or do that sort of thing. So maybe um, I'll have to work out for you to come back another afternoon and so we can have the fire. I'll just have to see how we go. Like hopefully it's a day like this. It'd be good if we had a week of bit of sunshine and then it can rain again after that. <laughs> but anyway, that's on this weekend. And also it's a full moon this Sunday, this Saturday night. So we've got the full moon and winter solstice Yule. So really powerful energies around for this weekend. But because uh, the full moon falls on winter solstice, so I still want to do a full moon circle, a women's full moon circle. So I've actually moved that to Monday night, five to six, twenty dollars, and it's a, a women's fairy full moon circle because it is International Fairy Day on Monday. So that's really cute. So we're going to be working with um, that fun, happy, mischievous, and sometimes dark energy of the Fae. Um, so yeah, we'll be working, doing a lot of work with nature healing and just connecting with nature as well for that. Um, and I've had lots of other ideas about events that I want to do coming up, probably when it gets a bit warmer. But yeah, I've got lots of ideas of different events, so I, I could keep getting ideas. I think, I don't know if my guides are telling me because I don't know where they come from. They just pop in my head. So, um, so yeah, I'll have to write some of them down because some of them I thought of last night. So I'll have to write them down. So so that I can um, remember to do the events because I'm looking forward to doing them actually I'm really excited about that. so um, so hello everyone whoever's there um, can you please comment underneath because I will read the comments back after like after um, so yeah just comment underneath for me and say what have we got here so these are new these are just small druzy quartz. They're just so unusual. Look at it. It's got all these little caves and things in them. 
So these are only $20 each. Look at the top of that. That bigger one that I have, have that was new, it's 65 But these ones are only 20 each. They're, I decided to do them for that special price. So Druzy Quartz is for relaxation, peace, harmony, imagination, creativity. Oh, Odin. See, that one's like a witch's stone. Can I see the fairies? Can I see the fairies? I can see Odin. Hey, Odin! Odin! <laughs> he said hello. So yeah, that is actually a witch's stone or a hag stone. It's got the hole through it that you can look through. So $20. So someone needs to snap, snuggle that up. One of you witchy ladies. So that's really rare to get that so you can hold it and look through it like that didn't even think of that when i bought it off the guy that that could, that's perfect for a witch stone okay so speaking of witch stones i've got two of these left so this one i'm a good witch after coffee yeah baby <laughs> And this one, they're only nine dollars each. It's just a bunch of hocus pocus buddies, ladies, <laughs> dudes. <laughs> so there's those two left that you can hang in your house or on your front door even. Might stop some people coming in that you don't want to come knocking on your door. <laughs> there's one of these left. I found this. I just thought I had none left. And it's selenite. It's 35 down to 20. It's quite a good size for 20 um, so I sold all the other ones so it's for crown and higher chakras calming protection it's cleansing it's psychic abilities um, great connection to the moon so great to have on your altar when there's full moons and just to represent the moon energy so that's 20 and then so I've got these these, it's got satin spa gypsum for these, but satin spa gypsum is just a type of selenite. So, so these these are twenty five each for the little hearts. So twenty five each. Actually, I just feel like I should do them for twenty. So I'm going to do twenty each. So I've got three of them, and they're twenty dollars each. Little selenite hearts. So that they'd be beautiful to give as a gift to someone or um, just to have on your altar too or have in your bedroom or yeah, just to have that beautiful cleansing, protective energy connecting with your psychic abilities. Okay. So they're new as well. As you can see, I just got them out of the wrapper. So Earth Magic. So next Saturday, we've got the next part of the Magic of Witchcraft course, which is group one going through the course, and it's part six, I think. I'm not sure. I've lost count. <laughs> but it's sigil magic anyway, sigil magic. So we'll be working on making up our own sigils. Instead of just copying other people's, we'll be learning how to make our own and draw our own and use them and put them in our book of shadows and use them for future spells like... There's all sorts of things you can use them for. So we'll be learning all about that. It's $30, 5 to 6 next next Saturday. And anyone can go, even if you're not doing the course, if you're just interested in sigils. Okay, Tsunami Wake Up Call is the first one. So something's going to wake you up to maybe what's going on in the world. Um, but it also could be a wake up call to something personal that's going on around you or someone close to you. You just get a wake up call of what you, sh you need to do in this situation or what you need to do next or which direction to go. It could even be a wake up call in your spiritual journey. So some message or something, maybe with the full moon this Saturday night and winter solstice Yule, something will come to you. If you want to book into that winter solstice Yule circle, please book in because um, there's limited numbers. 
but I also need to know how many people so I can get all the activities ready because there is quite a few activities we're going to be doing and also we will be having snacks and drinks so I need to know how many what I have to buy I don't live in town so I can't just duck to the shop so um, yeah if you can just let me know like book in you, uh, you're going to have the best time. I posted a video this morning and pictures of the last year's winter solstice Yule Wheel of the Year circle. I just love creating memories, memories that will stick with you forever and you'll always remember it. You'll just remember these magical times that we have out here. I love creating that for people. Okay, oh wow. I can't believe this one came up because I got this in a reading for myself but this is what I got a message about that I need to do a witch um, anyway I won't go into it because I don't want to tell everyone my ideas yet but it's something to do with this for workshops but this is all about a vision quest well it's about going within going on a deep journey meditative journey but also it's just uh, telling you that there's something that you need to spend time with your own company to to learn about to to learn about to um, get messages coming in for you but um, I suppose I can tell you I really want to do um, a three-part witches vision quest circle so it will go each part will be two hours and it'll be fifty dollars for each part and I'll, but i will want to do it when it's warmer in spring or summer um and it will be a really in-depth journey and each workshop will go into a different part of our soul and when you finish those three parts um it will be really it will really be awakening for you it will be enlightening it will be <sighs> it'll advance you on your spiritual path so yeah if anyone is interested in that can you comment underneath because I'd like to know because I'm in the process of working on stuff like that myself so that I want to um, teach it as well for other get people to go to do it for themselves and you need a space like this to do it that's away from all the noise of people and traffic and and just other your family you just need space where you're just not going to get bothered um, so yeah if you're interested in that please let me know it'll be really healing and it'll be amazingly awakening look yeah so let me know thing is you have to you'll have to not talk or anything for the whole time that we're going through this so it will be challenging for some people to just sit quietly and not talk at all away from others by themselves um, but in this space in this beautiful space so clouds shape shifting so I feel there is someone that you're gonna get a wake-up call regarding maybe someone in particular because they're not being their true self they're shape-shifting and hiding um, and you need to go within to get some messages around who this is and what they're actually hiding from you just so that you can be aware of what's going on so please let me let me know if you're interested in that which is vision quest circles because um, they'll be limited numbers as well um, I have to work out what day I'm going to have them I'll, it'll probably be I'll, it'll probably be a Saturday afternoon or something like that Saturday night Saturday at 5 like we do now um, yeah anyway I'll work out a time it could even be Sundays I have to work it out even though I prefer to have Sundays to myself because that's my day off um, it's just I have to work out when people can get here so so let me know if you're interested if you can comment underneath and what day that you would be interested in it unfortunately it can't be done online so I won't be able to do that with anyone online you have to come out here to do it so um, it's just you have to be in nature it's just part of the journey so if it happened to rain or anything we'd have to postpone that particular one so um, let me know if you prefer Saturdays or Sunday Saturday afternoon at 5 or would Sundays be better for you um, I'd prefer the Saturday if possible because like I said I have Sundays off and that's time spent with 
um, my family so anyway just let me know if you're interested to start off with and then we can work out times and days and everything it will be it will be fifty dollars and each workshop and they'll go for two hours there goes Odin and um, yeah it will be really special so just let me know if you're interested in that won't be till spring summer sometime so it's plenty of time to to work out if you'd like to do it and and to save up or what it's only fifty dollars so it'll cost you 150 for the three two they go for two hours each one so three two hour circles and they'll be smoking and like I'll be doing smoking with different herbs and things and it will yeah it'll just be a real experience a spiritual awakening kind of thing so let me know anyway i better go because i've got to post this now because since i couldn't do it live so magic and blessings thanks for connecting please comment underneath so i know you watch this and um hopefully we get the lives happening asap and you'll be able to um we'll be able to connect live again as soon as possible we're on to it <laughs> thanks everyone bye